Big win for workers. In the UK recently, they had 62 companies take part in a study where they shortened the work week to four days in the week instead of five, 32 hours max, while still making the same rate of pay. A majority of the businesses report that they will keep going with the shorter weeks as the employees were less stressed, uh, had better mental health while they were at work, and the revenue either stayed the same or grew. Employees obviously reported the benefits with 71% feeling less burned out, 39% less stressed, and 48% more satisfied with their job overall. Of the workers, 60% also said it was a lot easier to balance their work and home life with four work four day work weeks, with 73% reporting increased satisfaction in their lives, whether it be at work or while at home. The biggest issue with implementing this in the start seemed to be coordinating the schedules in a way that not only worked for the business, but worked for the employees. Most companies agreed to kind of do two groups of employees with one working two days while the other two were off and then swapping. So two days on, two days off. Uh, either way, companies did it, whether it was a two day on, two day off method, taking one day off, switching the days around. However, revenue grew 1.4% for 23 companies and 24 separate companies saw more than a 34% growth in revenue from the prior six months when they were working five-day work weeks or whatever their full work weeks were, with a drop scene in employees calling out sick, a drop scene in the percent of employees who said they would consider quitting or leaving for better employment opportunities. 92% of companies reported that they would continue on with the four-day work week, at least as a trial, with 30% saying that they were switching right now for it to be a permanent change. This is obviously a very good first step in putting powers back in the workforce and making working easier for workers, but I think we're still a long way from seeing this in America. Hopefully we do see it sooner rather than later as we're one of the few countries that don't have paid vacation days, paid maternity leave, a paid family leave as a whole, and, and workers are feeling the consequences of this draconian style workforce if I say so myself. If you enjoyed this video, we're Social Society. We're a commentary channel influenced by society, economy, and politics. We're a bit left-leaning on this channel, but we also are open to our right-wingers as well. The biggest thing here is having conversations that get everyone to the bottom of the truth. If that sounds like something that could interest you, consider smashing that subscribe button, leaving us a like, or even commenting on this video. Because the only way we become a society is together. Peace.